ways of making perfect holes in ZBrush. Number one, Z Modeler. I know a bunch of people that hate Z Modeler brush, but believe in me, it worths it. I'm gonna prove you now. With your mesh selected, activate the polyframe, press B and then Z. And then you have here, Z Modeler. Leave your cursor over the vertex, not the edge, not the face the vertex. Click and hold spacebar. You're going to have a lot of options. Everything you need to do is click here. Split. Done. You see? Z modeler doesn't hurt anyone. It's super simple. On the vertex, you click, hold and drag to create a circle. Wow. Now that you make the holes that you want, hold Ctrl and Shift, click on the holes and everything gonna disappear. Now we invert the selection by still holding Ctrl and Shift, click and drag in the canvas. You're gonna invert the mask, come here to tool panel, geometry, modify topology, delete hidden. And there you go, you have perfect holes. Second one, Boolean. Many people know already how Booleans work, but for those of people who doesn't know, Boolean is a technique that 3D software is used to. If you have a surface, you can pick another object and you can subtract this object over any other surface. You can understand it now. I want to subtract this mesh over this other mesh here. Everything I need to do is come here, click Live Boolean. Then here in the subtool panel, every subtool has these little icons here. Instead of this first option, you click on the second one and then you're gonna see that when you click there your mesh will disappear everything you need to do is activate the polyframe by clicking here or just pressing shift f now press w or e or r to bring the gizmo and then you click and hold and insert it over the other mesh and when you remove the polyframe pressing shift f again you're gonna see that you are subtracting that mesh over this other one Mwah. Perfect. Third option, Dynamesh Masking. You can pretty much use Dynamesh for making perfect holes, but instead of that traditional way of using the brush to try to mask a perfect hole, if you want it to be really, really precise, hold Ctrl, click here on Alpha, select this Alpha 58, and also here you just click on this drag rack, keep holding Ctrl, come here to the focal shift, put it on minus 100 and now you click and drag on the mesh then you're gonna have a perfect circle click outside the canva it will invert the mask now you can with the gizmo just place the gizmo here and then you can move it inside and then done you pretty much have another perfect hole and an extra fourth tip for you if you want to learn more about zbrush just hit the follow button and this is how you make perfect holes in zbrush got you Hit the like and follow and share with your best friend or any friend.